Yeah. Uh, it's been a long day, have you? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Carlisle. Carlisle today. Oh really? Yeah. That's pretty good going there. Yeah, yeah. A few miles. Yeah, I did a few. <laughs> Huh. It's like 86, is it? Just a couple of times. Oh, just the once. No, <laughs> it lo <laughs> loads, yeah. yeah. Morning. Uh, we're just uh, about to be leaving uh, this place as the Premier Inn that we stayed in last night rather than a travel lodge, make things different. Uh, very nice, Premier Inn. It is very nice, very modern, very new. Uh, Peter's just been lubing up his bike, his bike's <laughs> just been lubing up his bike um, to get it. Kevin, and he's been lubing up for Kevin because we've been, uh, with all the rain that we've had, we've uh, dried the bikes out quite a lot. So, the morning. The plan is to go and find some breakfast because we don't fancy having breakfast here. It'll take too long. So uh, we're going to head to um, a McDonald's, which is en route, bang en route, uh, on the way to Gretna Green. Uh, we'll be in Gretna by eight miles time, which is, uh, which is not bad. I guess it's to Scotland. And, and from there, we just keep following the M74, but along the, the, the old road, whatever it's called, the, probably the A74, I guess. Um, we're going to follow that all the way through, all the way up to Glasgow, where we drop into the bottom end of Glasgow, which is called Hamilton. And Hamilton's where we're going to stay for the night. Um, weather today is looking reasonable. Uh, a bit of a... It's going to get hot, yeah. It, it should get, get quite hot, isn't it? And um, a bit of wind, a bit of breeze coming from the sides, from our left-hand side, so it comes from the west. Um, but it's a long stint today. It's about 85 miles We'll see how we go. We don't have to do that whole distance. We could always jump in the car for the last few if we wanted to, but the last probably 20 miles is generally downhill into Glasgow from the from the tops that we do. So um, it should be a good day. We'll see you then. Cheers. Bye. Football ground, training grounds. Happening in McDonald's, and we emptied the place <laughs> as soon as we walked in. Breakfast done, back on the road in a minute. So, yeah, all right, that's breakfast done, and now on to Scotland. So, we're heading for Gretna Green, which is going to be about six miles away, and we'll stop for another selfie when we get there. So we're about to cross into Scotland, just around this corner. And there's the sign ahead of us. Uh, on the right hand side is uh, the toll bar. It's the first house in Scotland. Or oh, the last one, depends which direction you're going in. Hey everybody, hey. we've made it to Scotland. And England is way back, well I'm standing in England actually. There's Scotland, we've made it to Gretna. And um, sun's out, a bit of cloud, and it looks like it's going to be a good day. So. 
lots to do. We've done about, oh, it's only about eight miles since we left the, the uh, hotel. Not that far, to be honest. Ten. Ten miles. Yep. Ten miles in. Uh, excellent. Ten miles in. And about another 75 to go for the day. But um, good progress so far. Uh, we'll catch you in Scotland. See ya. Hey. There's one of those road signs behind us. I keep finding on uh, lands and on groats. It gives kind of the mileage to where we're up to. It's kind of useful. Uh, but that says what? 300, that's say 360. 360 miles of direct to Donna Groats. Could be. Um, so, we know we've got to do a lot of miles today. We're pretty much going all the way to Glasgow today from here. So, so fair ways to go, as I was saying before. Only way to get there is get back on the road and get moving. So, yeah. Whoever thinks putting these chippings down on rows is a good idea, needs a head examining. False economy. It'll be up in no time. Useless. And it's really rough to ride on. So for cyclists, not good. And when cars go past, they flick up the little grit, which hits you. And so it's not, it's not a nice thing at all. Hey ho. Stopped uh, 20 miles in at a place called Echofecken, which we always think is funny. Yeah. Um, the road surfaces around here are horrendous. Um, it's only the last probably um, 100 meters, 150 meters or so, has uh, been nice and smooth. Still, um, quick rest, and uh, we'll, we'll head on. You can see the weather's still quite good, um, and we're expecting the same all day. See ya. We just stopped at um, the side of the road at, I can't remember where we are now, Be Beatty I think it is, or something like that. A little small village on the way up, we're about 40 miles into the journey, and we stopped at the side of the road here to uh, to get a quick uh, snack, a um, cup of tea, which is really nice, and then we'll get going again. We're about uh, 17 miles from where we used to stop at, which is Abington. Uh, but this time we're going to go further by about another 25 miles perhaps to get to Hamilton which is just out on the outskirts of Glasgow that's the aim of, of today um, going well the wind hasn't been too unkind to us all day it's windy which you might be looking at um, and um, yeah, otherwise doing quite well we, we caught up with two guys who were doing Lands at John O'Groats we met them briefly on the way into Kendall and um, we saw them get them again this morning so we cycled along about five miles with us before uh, they continued on their way. But uh, otherwise, quite uneventful. That's a good progress. So we're going on now. This, this is the way we're going in, down that way. And we're going to join back on the A74. Uh, we'll catch you hopefully by the time we get to Appington for a stop there. See ya. where we are. We just come down from um, this way is where we stopped, so it's Beatty, where we stopped. Um, and it's 10 miles uphill to here. Um, pretty exhausted actually, just after the 10 miles. Really sore. And the, the roads get quite rough. Uh, you can see where we're going to that way, where the windmills are. Wind turbines uh, down that way. And that's where we head to next. Um, so it's 10 miles to a place called Hamilton, which is where we stopped last time we did this. Um, so it's 10 miles to that. There's a service station there, so we're going to stop and um, again have a bit of a comfort break at that stage. We'll get to the end. See you now. Oh, 
back to downhill with the wind. Hey everybody, really hot, really hot. Uh, we've got 25 to go. Uh, we stopped at the Abington services uh, just off the M74. Um, uh, we've just had a cup of tea, Holly and Catherine just made us some cups of tea. And they stopped right around here. Great countryside, look at that. Really pretty. Anyway, back to the road. These birds, yeah. they fly in front of you, they're really quite cool. <laughs> they almost bounce in the air. Yeah. <laughs> 